Good morning, everyone. Good morning. We are having breakfast in paradise. Yes, we are. Look at the view. You can't even see a great view right here. You guys will see it better once we stand up and uh, look at everything down there. It's very early in the morning. What time is it? It's like eight something. It's like nine. O'clock. It's almost nine. We have to go do our excursion soon, so we're gonna have to eat our breakfast, take off down the uh, gangway here. We've never actually been to this pier, so I know previously I said that there's more than one port. Mm -hmm. I think there's more than one pier in oh, Cozumel okay. because that over there is the pier that we actually came to the originally. Because I remember sitting like right over there in that area looking at the ships. So we've never actually been to this pier. So we're gonna do some exploring of everything down there a little later, probably after we do the excursion look how awesome this all looks it's so, it's so blue the water is extremely blue. and it's not even a very sunny day yet I don't know if it will be because it looks like it's very cloudy and overcast mm -hmm. today but if the Sun comes out we'll really see all the blues all the different colors with our sunglasses on we can see like all the different color blues yeah, it's extremely blue. yeah. Yeah, I don't know if you guys are seeing it on camera right now because it's really kind of too bright out here for me to see my screen that good. But whenever I put on my shades and then take them off, it's like, what in the world? It's like, it's such a like big difference. Hopefully it does get really sunny later in the day when we come back up here so we can see all the different colors. So you guys can see all the different colors. But now we're going to go ahead head over there to do our excursion. It's going to be fun. Follow the speedboat. We're coming. Well, we've made it to the excursion. Speed boats, yes. So we're gonna be doing a speed boat scuba beach excursion. We're gonna be driving one of those in a second. Who's gonna drive first, me or you? Chris? You want me to drive first? Okay, because we can't switch out while we're actually out on the water. Oh, look at the jet skis in the distance. That'd be fun too. And we're off. Let's go catch up to the group that living in the dust. <laughs> They said not to go too fast right now. Yes. <laughs> Crystal, are you oh, going to get seasick? I don't know. I hope not. <laughs> oh my God, I hope I don't. Crystal wanted me to go first, so yes. if I mess up, you guys get to see my mess up. Oh my One thing does. I will say out here is the water is less blue yeah, over it here. Is. Well, it's like the port has all the blue water over here. They don't even, I don't know what's the That's difference. That's why the port is over there. That's probably true. Oh my gosh, I hope I don't get seasick for real. Yeah, so we're barely right now just getting in a line, so we're not really, uh, I gotta make sure I get in this line. So we're making sure that we're like taking off. We haven't gone fast yet. Yeah. We're kind of just like trying to get used to it. One try... hand on the accelerator. Yeah, yeah, I got it, I got it. Oh, we're finally getting a break and it's the snorkeling time, but there are little jellyfish. I don't know if you can see it, like little black dots down there. And those are supposed to be like little jellyfish. They told us ahead of time that there have been jellyfish out here the last couple days, but we've all agreed as a group that we're gonna go ahead and get in. So we might get lots of little welts on us. I don't know yet, but the water over here is super blue. So right now there's a, a lead boat up there. One of the tour guides is towing us to a good spot to do some snorkeling. It looks like people are actually snorkeling over there in the distance. That's probably where we're gonna head out to. Hopefully these jellyfish are not an issue. But we're definitely having fun already. The water is so blue over here. Beautiful. Man, can you just imagine how blue it would look during a sunny day? I know, it's pretty overcast. Oh, this is so cool. So now we're just snorkeling here. Crystal's right there in front of me. <laughs> she just floating in there. The current is actually very, very strong. And right here, the water is so clear. Hey, Chris, what are you doing? <laughs> I got freaked out for a little bit. <laughs> Crystal has a hard time whenever something's covering her nose. Yeah. So right now this is like really like uh testing her really. Yes, I used to not have any problems with it, but I don't know. It started getting worse recently. I, don't I think know. what happens is like over time as you have it on, it'll get better. Yeah. Like, remember we went snorkeling the other time in the uh, the spring? Yes, I freaked out it too. Yeah, but it takes a little bit of time and 
unfortunately, my goggles aren't working, guys. Yay. So I can't really go underwater. But we're probably going to switch out, me and Crystal. But that's not going to stop me from showing you guys. Because I'll be able to see this water later. So I'm going to put the camera underwater and see it all later for sure. This is definitely fun with the water being as clear as it is. Still takes quite a bit of effort though to get around places to try to keep up with the glide. Do you see a jellyfish? Yeah, I see like multiple. Oh gosh. We're playing a game called Dodge Jellyfish. <laughs> Oh no, Crystal's in the driver's seat. All right, so we're just waiting here before until everyone's ready. The water was so nice. I hope I got really good footage for you guys. The jellyfish were cool. You can actually see the jellyfish like pulsing, swimming like this. Oh, and there's like swarms of fish. Oh, I would totally do this again. This part is super scary though. All I know is I'm definitely holding on to this while Crystal's driving. Give it some gas. <laughs> oh yeah. I don't know if you guys can hear me, but Crystal is definitely scaring me already. Well, I believe we're wrapping it up on the speedboat part of this uh, excursion. The water over here is still really clear. It's just the bottom is not as blue for whatever reason. Don't know why, but it's still really clear water over here where we're returning the boat still. But it was definitely very, very fun. <laughs> I highly recommend you do this. The tour guide said I was a professional driver. <laughs> you really were doing a lot better than I was. You think so? Yeah. We almost flipped once. <laughs> Only once. <laughs> But it was it was a lot of fun now that we're back on land We get like an hour and an hour and a half at this area right here And there's only like six of us in our group guys. So we have this whole area to ourselves it's a whole island to ourselves. Yeah, I mean well, we're not actually on an island, but <laughs> Yeah, we have this whole like private little area to ourselves We're sitting in hammocks now probably gonna relax for a little bit and then maybe jump in the pool The pool's not that big. It's pretty small. What are you doing? What the? <laughs> She's cocooning back there <laughs> I didn't realize, I just hear her chuckling back there. I knew she was up to something. What are you doing? Look, I'm a cocoon, now I'm an ugly butterfly. <laughs> She's not ugly though. She's really beautiful, right? Crystal's still cocooning over there. I want you guys to see, like, this right here is the pool area. It's not, like, that big, like I said earlier. Over there is, like, some seating where they have food. Apparently they have, like, you can get, what is it, fajitas? Yeah, fajitas. Chips and salsa. Fajita, guacamole. Something else. Oh, quesadillas is what oh, he said. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know if we're gonna eat here or not, but we'll go look over there, I'm sure, in a second. And then there's the coconuts right there. Can we get some of those fresh coconuts, please? <laughs> I don't know if that's actually on the menu, but it would be cool if it was. Uh oh, look what Crystal decided to get. I'm punched! <laughs> <laughs> it's probably gonna be punching her soon, and she's gonna be saying, I do not recommend. <laughs> no, this one's not in a pineapple. You're right, it was the pineapple. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so she decided to get a drink real fast because we are going to be leaving here soon because there's not much to do here right now. We kind of just want to go do some more exploring by the actual yeah, port itself. Get some food as well. Oh yeah, do some uh, shopping. Mm -hmm. Well, looking around at least. There, there was a lot of shopping stuff over there. I don't know how much shopping we're going to do, but Crystal does want to look for souvenirs, of course. So we made it back to the port area. Check out the awesome sign right there. Look at the water. The sun has decided to come out and then the ship is in the background. So I'm going to have to get into this video though, because me and Chris both have to be right in front of this Cozumel sign. That's a lot better right there, right? <laughs> yeah. Got Cozumel, got the ship, got both of us in it. So Such a great day to be here too. Oh, look at this right behind that Cozumel sign you can come down here you can actually get into the water what hey I see a fish it's actually a fish like right over there somewhere but yeah look how clear this is I'm gonna actually see how deep we can get into this water because I kind of want to get over here in this area but it looks pretty deep over there uh oh it looks like crystals already ready to get in good luck Chris be careful on those rocks because I'm sure they're not the softest things is it cold water 
It can't be colder than the boat. It's the same water, Chris. <laughs> I think I've decided I'm just going to sit right here because Crystal is having some real difficulties in there. See, if you had hot shoes, I would not have difficulties. The rocks that my feet are on down here are actually hairy. Yeah, like they're slimy. slimy. Yeah, it's not something I want to get into to try to get back up. So I'm going to stay right here. I'll be Crystal's helper. But look how nice this looks, guys. No filter needed. Like, this just looks so amazing. The water is so blue. I'm so glad the sun came out so you guys can really see how blue it is. It's super blue. Okay, change of plans. I said I wanted to get in over here. I'm getting in over here. Woo. So it's about to my chest right now. <laughs> the water is like literally on my chest and that's without the waves. Crystal's still way over there. Whoa, this is like magical. I think I actually see people out in the distance over there Swimming, yeah, they're actually swimming over there. They must have like uh, snorkel gear. I mean, if we had snorkeling gear, that would be crazy. I don't think there's any fish over here. Well, change of plans, guys. We've decided to just stay here for a little while and swim. It's really nice water, so clear. We, we're just like over here just swimming like for a while now. And I had to come get the GoPro because I know you guys want to see us out there in real time. Crystal, you're swimming, but you're not moving. Okay, now you're moving. Look at her go. She's like a fish. So nice. Yeah, we didn't even need to go like anywhere. You don't have to go on any excursions, literally. Yes. It's right here by, what is that, Senor Frogs behind me? Yeah. And like that tequila, a go-go or something. <laughs> it's so nice, like the ship is right there. You don't ever risk missing your ship, you know? Yeah. We actually have like a few hours left, right? Yeah. Oh, 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 wow. Crystal's getting a little too deep. I can I save her. Get on this rock. Yeah, there's actually a rock right here. Yeah. Can you reach the rock? I'm on it. Okay, yeah. Watch how tall I get when I step on this rock. Oh, okay, here we go. Look at that, this is a nice big rock out here. So we don't have any goggles on us, but we can always watch the video later. So I'm gonna go ahead and put it underwater here and I'm gonna go ooh, ah later. But right now you guys are gonna see it before we see it. So, how was that, Angel? Was it good? Ooh, put some booze and some ah. in there if it was good. If it was bad, put some booze. I wish there was some fish in here so it could clean my crusty feet. What was that? Say it's that again? recording! What'd you say? <laughs> well, we're headed back to the ship because we're hungry and we don't feel like leaving the actual port area to go find food in Cozumel. We're lazy. <laughs> don't judge us. We know it. But here's one last view. Of the, well, it won't be the last view because we gotta do the, um, watch the uh, sail away party, right? Yeah. And that happens at like five o'clock or something like that. We're gonna sail away to have like a big party on the top of the ship. Like, and it's like dancing, mm -f, mm -f, mm -f, mm -f. but yeah, this is like the close up view, the last close up view we're gonna get of the water with the different shades of blue, the light blues over here, light blues out there, and then dark blues mixed in. So awesome. That's the best way to describe it. It's just so awesome. Oh my gosh, I cannot just not show this, guys. Look at this. Crystal just says it looks so fake. It does. So the sun is out. So earlier when we had breakfast, we were up here, the same spot where we were actually over there. And it looked like this, but without looking like this. Oh my gosh, it's so windy up here. So we're eating on the ship, obviously, because we didn't want to go back out. We might actually still go out there. We haven't decided because we were really hungry. So we had to like quickly change, yeah. get some food, and then we might go back out there, but not, let's not count on it because it might not happen. I have found my new favorite dessert on this ship. It's actually one of like the only good desserts they have, in my opinion. <laughs> it is an Oreo concoction. I don't know what this is actually. It's like a cream, but it also has like the Oreo um, cream, filling. cream filling in it. So it's not like very unsweet because a lot of desserts here are lightly sweet. But this one, oh my gosh, it's like eating an Oreo, but like in a fancy way. My favorite without a doubt. Well, it's about time for us to be leaving Cozumel. It's about to be the sail away party, not too long. But I did want to show you guys some really cool photos we got when we were doing the speedboats. And those were fun. The pictures came out great. Some of the pictures are not so great, kind of make us look weird in weird positions. Oh my gosh, I'm not showing those. But yeah, we had a great time here in Cozumel. But it's about to wrap up. Sail away party is starting soon. I did want to say though, we were swimming the second time, like when we actually got into the water behind the Cozumel sign, it was right down in that area right there. Yeah, right between uh, Senor Frogs and the uh, Tequila Agogo. It was like literally right in that area. So if you guys ever come here and want to like swim, it's it a little dip in the water. 
it? Yeah, it does depend though if you come to this pier or the other pier because yeah. we went to a different one last time we were here in Cozumel. So who knows? There's probably a swimming spot in that one or somewhere near that one, but at this one, it's right there. It's official. We are leaving. <laughs> Chris was saying, look at that. Let's take the toilet bowl because the color blue. <laughs> so it's time to sail away from Cozumel. Bye, Cozumel. But that's okay, because Cosmo might be gone, but Costa Maya's coming up. Yes, we're excited. We've yes. never been there before. Never been there. Hopefully it's a lot of fun. We're going to wing it as we're there <laughs> because we don't have any excursions or anything planned there. Mm -hmm. Going to explore the uh, port area. Hopefully it's fun as Cosmo was. Yes. But we will see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching this one. Bye, Bye. guys. Bye, Cosmo.